From Citizens Bank Park tonight, it's the middle game of this three-game series as the Philadelphia Phillies look to get on the board when they take on the Baltimore Orioles in interleague play. Phillies trying to get things turned around once again. They've lost five of the last six as their record has fallen to 53 and 47 on the season. Tonight, they'll have their leading winner on the mound. Taiwan Walker goes for his 12th victory of the season. He's 11 and four with a 4-11 ERA. There's the first strikeout of the night. He got him looking with a sinker at 94 miles an hour. Bounced out to shortstop. First chance for Trey Turner. Throws it a little low. Dug out by his buddy Bryce Harper. Two outs here in the first. Santander, he was 0 for 4 last night with a strikeout. That's going to get down for a base hit for Santander. And it's going to go up against the wall. Anthony streaking for second, and he'll make it standing. A two-out double for Anthony Santander. Fly ball right field. Castellanos, all he has to do is cross over. He was deep enough. He makes the catch. And the inning is over. No runs, one hit, one man left. Middle of the first. It's the Orioles nothing and the Phillies coming up. Facing right-hander Kyle Gibson, their former teammate. Kyle Gibson leads the Orioles in innings pitch with 121 of those on the year. And he starts the game off with a strikeout. So two away. And that'll bring first baseman Bryce Harper up to the plate. And on one pitch, he pops it up in foul ground. Long way to go for Westberg, and he makes the catch. Jordan Westberg, a tremendous play. And it's a 1-2-3 start for Kyle Gibson. We'll go to the second tonight. No score. Ryan Mountcastle leads off for the Orioles. And he rips this up the middle and through. A base hit for Mountcastle, who hit the longest home run of the season here at Citizens Bank Park a night ago. To the right side and through. Mountcastle headed for third base, and he'll make it easily. First and third with nobody out to start the second for the Orioles. What a start here in the top of the second for the Orioles. Well, here's Austin Hayes, who has been in a bit of a slump post-All-Star break. Hayes rips this into left field, and that's a base hit off the wall. Mountcastle will score. Frazier will stop at third, and it's an RBI double for Austin Hayes. 1-0 Baltimore. Ball four. Going to load him up, and you got Westberg, who had the home run last night, his first major league home run. Bases are loaded, 1-0 Orioles, and a called strike three. Threw him a cutter, second strikeout. Now you can see your way out of this with a ground ball that maybe. was absolutely huge to get that strikeout fly ball short left field marsh coming in frazier's going to tag but he's not going to go anywhere two outs and a big one there here's a situation where taiwan got himself into trouble now he's trying to work himself out one with a breaking ball out towards short left center field here comes marsh and he makes the catch and the inning is over the damage is limited. One run for the Orioles. Full count to Mountcastle. Payoff pitch for Taiwan Walker. 3-2. That ball smacked into center. There's a base hit for Ryan. And he is two for two. And Mountcastle's a two-out base runner. Adam Frazier, who singled already tonight, he'll bat for a second time. The pitch is stroke down the right field line. That's a hit for Frazier. Start the merry-go-round. Mountcastle coming to third. Tony Mancellino waves him in. The ball is dug out very late. Frazier's going to go to third. The cut throw is in time. And Frazier is tagged out by Bohm. It will go down as an RBI double scoring Mountcastle before the tag at third. So the Orioles take a 2-0 lead. Here's Alec Bohm to lead it off. Bohm hitting 279 with nine home runs. That's a hanger that's pulled toward the left field line. It's a fair ball. As it kicks toward the corner, Bohm will pull into second base. A leadoff double with 17th of the year. And that's a good way to start here in the third. Nice. Flips it out to left field. Bohm stops at third. First and third, nobody out. And it brings Johan Rojas up. Line drive out to center field. That's going to drop for a hit. Three in a row for the Phils as Bohm scores. Johan Rojas is making his mark. Well, the score now is a two to one. It's a one run game. Yeah, first and second, the top of the order. Tom, you'd think they'd get some more here. 2-2 two -two is popped up. Down the third baseline, it's a foul territory. Westberg puts it away. All right, so one out. That'll bring up Trey Turner. Bouncer over to shortstop, picked on a big hop. They go to third to get the lead runner. All right, so now Harper with runners at first and second. You've got excellent speed on the base paths. Ground ball to right side. Frazier gobbles it up. 
Phillies had something cooking. They had a run, and the first three hitters had a hit, but then nothing else. Well, we're headed to the bottom of the sixth inning. Phillies still down a run. One away. And Trey Turner's coming up. So we get a miss. Five strikeouts for Kyle Gibson. The thing about Trey, too, and he hears it, he knows it. He has admitted, he goes, I'm just not playing well. Here's Harper, 0 for 2 tonight. Fly ball right field, that one's deep, and this game is tied! It's a 2-2 game. Bryce Harper with his fifth home run of the year. Well, maybe that stirs the pot a little bit. Boy, you ain't kidding it. How badly did they need this? See Rushman try to reach out and snatch that thing before Bryce could swing. All right, so it's a 2-2 game. Orioles are in a tight one yet again. 2-2 into the eighth. Matt Strom against Ryan O'Hernan. But again, it's going to be up to the Orioles offense to figure something out late. O'Hernan to right. Castellanos is back. He's at the wall, and that baby's gone. Left on left for Ryan O'Hearn. And the Orioles regain the lead 3-2. to two. Come on now, Hitman Hearns. And what do you know? Ryan O'Hearn does it again. A bomb. And guess what? The Orioles are back on top 3-2. to two. All right, Mount Kessel's been on base four times. And now Frazier's coming up. Line drive out to right field. Castellanos is over, and he makes the catch. What a grab. His throw to first is not in time. Way to use your length, Nick. Wow, what a play. I thought that was another run for the Baltimore Orioles, but Nick Cassianos robbed Frazier of his third hit of the game. I mean, if he was an inch shorter, Tom, that's a run for the Orioles. What a play. The Orioles will take that one-run lead into the bottom of the ninth inning, and it will be Yandier Cano making his 44th appearance. Had a day off yesterday, but not today. So one out here in the ninth inning. Here's Bryce Harper, who homered to tie the game his last time up. Opposite way, that'll be in for a base hit. So Bryce is aboard, a one-out single. The tying run is on first. And Bryson Stott is the last hope for the Phillies here tonight, as the Phillies staring at their sixth loss in the last seven games. And he lines one into right field. That's a base hit. Harper steaming around second, heading to third. The ball kicks around in the corner. Dusty's waving him home. The throw is off the glove of Frazier. The Phillies have tied it up. Bryson Stott, an RBI double here in the bottom of the ninth inning. It's a 3-3 game. That's a beautiful piece of hit right there by Bryson Stott. And his Las Vegas buddy was flying around the bases. Beautiful, beautiful cutting of the bases right there. Now, oh, JT, let's finish this thing. Yeah, now the winning run is at second base. And a pitch bounced out to shortstop. Mateo charges. Real Muto runs well. He had trouble getting it out. Safe at first. The inning is still alive. An infield hit puts runners at first and third. All right, so the Orioles will challenge this one. Baltimore is challenging the safe call at first base. Here we go, slowing it down, last stride. Safe. He's there, yeah. After view, the call on the field is confirmed. The runner is safe. Confirmed. First and third now. There are two outs, and it will be Cano versus Alec Bohm. Well, here's Alec Bohm with a chance to win it in the bottom of the ninth inning. Runners on first and third. Not too many folks have left. Not too many are sitting. And the 1 1. Ground ball toward the hole. Yes! Base it into left field. The Phillies have come from behind here in the bottom of the ninth inning. They've scored twice. Alec Bohm wins it with an RBI single to left. And what a celebration that's carrying the team into right field. 4 3 win. The Phillies have knocked off the Orioles. Ain't no better feeling in the world, Tom, to watch your teammate jump over that no. rail. 